Hey everyone! Oh my gosh, it's been like forever. Um, I've been like super, super busy um, with like everything in like uh, spring break, summer, like it's just been crazy for me. Um, I just, I sat here for like two hours, like I, I don't even remember how to make a video. Um, but today I wanted to do like a quick like little tutorial, like catch up on life the past like two months. Um, I wanted to do a quick tutorial on how to fill in your eyebrows because I know a bunch of people just don't really know how to do it so I see like people walking around with like <laughs> retarded eyebrows. Um, no, but a lot of people have really thin eyebrows like me or like it just kind of comes right here and then stops and doesn't even arch. Um, so I wanted to do that really quick. Um, so let's go ahead and get into that before I just start like talking about everything. Okay, so are you so ready to see this eyebrow that I really don't have? Uh, <laughs> it's not really that bad, it's just, I think it's really thin and like it just kind of goes like whoop. <laughs> and this one is like perfectly shaped and arched. Like this has no arch and it's so thin. So um, this is what I do to kind of give it a shape and make it a little bit darker. Um, first I get a brow pencil and it just has like the like the brush on one end and um, the pencil on the other. And so what I do first is let me get closer. Oh God. Um, I draw the shape on. Oh I lied. I put a, um, a gel over it. And it's just like liquid gel. And this one's by Chanel and it really, really sucks. And I can't wait till I'm out of it to get a new one. Um, so first after the gel has dried, I'm going to just draw the shape that I want on there. So that it kind of looks like this. So you kind of have an outline and if it looks kind of messy it'll be okay. Um, so once you have the outline on I'm just going to take an angled brush and it's really dirty obviously and I'm going to take this NYX um, Smoky Eyes palette and it's just basically a bunch of like browns and blacks and stuff and what I do is I mix a brown and a black to kind of get the color that I need to uh, fit my eyebrows. And so I start out on the ends where it kind of fan, like wings out and then I just work my way inward. I don't want to really get too much like right on the inner brow because I want it to try and look as natural as possible. So once I have the powder on, I'm going to take that brush from the brow pencil and just kind of and then I'm just gonna kind of and then I'm just gonna kind of brush it out so that there's not really a fine line from the um, where you drew the outline for your brow. And then like sometimes like I just think it's a little bit too thick down here and I'll just kind of thin it out. So there is my eyebrow routine and it's like three seconds. It doesn't, I don't understand like, it's like three seconds so I really don't understand what the big deal about how like people say like, oh I don't know how to draw my eyebrows or fill them in like, it takes like three seconds. Stop walking around with raggedy ass eyebrows. Okay, <laughs> so now that you know how to fill in your eyebrows, hopefully that'll help you a lot more now that you actually know how to do it and not complain and have great eyebrows. Um, but other than that, I've just been like busy with like going out like so much like because of the whole spring break and like summer and like tanning and working and finding more jobs to do and like it's just been like really hectic for me for the past like two and a half months and Finally, I have like some time to be like, okay, like let me make a video since it's been almost two months and like I'm losing subscribers. Um, but yeah.
but yeah, I'm so sorry that I haven't made a video in almost two months. And I'm so happy to finally be back because I want to get into the routine of making videos again. Um, I'm glad that it's summer and that I'm not pasty anymore and I'm like getting tan. I like that a lot. Um, I don't know where the rest of y'all live, but down here in Texas, it's getting pretty hot. Um, but yeah, I plan on making another tutorial tomorrow. We'll see how that works out. I know I definitely will not be making one this weekend because it'll all just be so busy, but I'm definitely going to try tomorrow to make a new video for y'all. Um, but if you have any tutorials or any other questions that you would like me to do for y'all, that would be great. Um, I always love new ideas. Um, wait. Oh, and so I wanted to show y'all a couple quick new things that I got that are from the drugstore. And I know a lot of people are always sending me messages like, do you only use like expensive products and like high end stuff? And I'm, most of the time, yeah, I do because I just, that's what I prefer. I really don't get the same results with like drugstore products. So recently I just went to the store and try to get a few products and so my all-time three favorite drugstore products so far are let's see these two mascaras the one by one and the falsies they are both by Maybelline I really like the one by one a lot because of the brush I don't know I like it a lot and then the falsies one most of y'all I'm pretty sure I've tried it already it's just I mean I like it a lot and the formula on both of these are really good and my last product is this CoverGirl True, oh, True Blend uh, Minerals Bronzer. <laughs> okay, look, I don't know if you can see inside of this, but I've had this for about a month already. And it's just like a powder. And I use this only on my neck and my chest just because like when I go out, like to the clubs and stuff I want my chest to be like super bronzed and glowy and glittery but this is really great and it's inexpensive if you want to not waste your good bronzers like on your neck and on your chest I suggest you go get this it's really good um, but that's it those are the only three new products that I've really got that I love so far so I plan to go shopping I'm gonna try and get more drugstore products so I can like show reviews on them for you guys so you guys can go out and buy them um, but yeah, that's it. I hopefully can, I'm pretty sure I will make a video tomorrow. And not to mention that I have been going to the gym like every day. So that's just kind of like messing things up for me. Like I'll wake up and go to the gym. And normally I would just wake up, get ready and make a video. But it's just a long process to go to the gym, come back, take a shower. I'm super exhausted and get ready. It's ridiculous. <laughs> But yeah, I will have more videos coming for you all soon, and thanks for watching. Bye! It's Britney, bitch.